Hey guys, and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be restoring the Sega 3-head candy machine. You can see it's got its problems. It's pretty dirty looking. And the glass is all fogged up from being in the sun. So we're going to tear it apart and get it all cleaned up. Pop her open. Take these little candy dividers out and just pull them out of their slots. And we're going to pop this old fog, fogged up glass out. Then just pull out the candy wheels. Alright, now it's a straight shot down to the change. Alright, now with the mechanisms. This one seems to work really good. Like it's brand new. But these two, on the other hand, they stick awful. But the good news is, is I got this whole box of parts, so we're going to see. We can pop those out and put the new ones in. Alright, if you're going to take these out too, go ahead and loosen up this screw right here. It's the Phillips screwdriver, that one right there. And there's one down here on the side too. After you take that screw out, you may need to loosen this one right here too. And just wiggle your coin back a little bit and pull it out of there. From here, you can go ahead and pull your candy slides out to clean them too. Go ahead and pop that back in. Now I'm going to pop the new coin back in there. Now just tighten those two little screws back down. You should be good. Alright, now I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. Be right back. Alright, there's those all taken out. Alright, all those are installed. Alright, now for the candy wheels. We're just going to take these screws out with the Phillips screwdriver. Take the candy wheel out. Alright, you're just going to want to lift this. Set it to the side. And left your candy wheel right out there. I'm just going to repeat that two more times. Take these two out. One. And two. Alright, now I'm going to take all the candy wheels and this plate in here and soak them in hot water until and scrub it until everything comes off. Much better. Alright, so putting the candy wheels back together, you want to get your candy wheel and then your candy divider. You want to line that notch up to how much candy you want to be in it. Just set it down in there to where it spins really easy. Then get this thing right here. And set it on there to where the screw holes line up in the diagonal corners. Alright, then you want to take your screwdriver and put your screws back in. In the diagonal corners and each one of your candy wheels. Pop that bad boy right back in there. Then you want to set your glass front in there and just leave it lean in there for just a minute. Which that is actually a new one. I ordered off CandyMachines.com for only... I think it came out to be $20, and it looks really nice compared to the old one, as you can tell. So just get on CandyMachines.com and search for a triple shop glass front, and they should pop up. Then you want to slide your candy dividers in here. You want to mix and match with these grooves. Get some on each side of it. These little metal grooves right here. That way it gets wedged in there. And it don't come undone. Alright, now I'm going to scrub the outside. Alright guys, there's what the finished product looks like. I think it looks a lot better. Now that we have all working mechanisms. Clear glass. And it's all been scrubbed from the inside. So it's all nice and sanitary. Alright, thank you guys for watching. Hope you have a good day. And please remember to like and subscribe. Goodbye.